guys, welcome back to Sassy Saturday episode 7. I am so sorry again. I think this is like the third time in a row, but we get like we went out again and I didn't have time to come home and film for you because again the lighting would be bad and I just want to make these videos as good as possible, but I have some really really exciting news for you guys this week. Um and that is I got partnered with Style Hall and I'm so excited. This is like I can't believe it even happened like I wanted to be partnered with Style Hall like so bad like and then I'm like I applied and I was like I don't really think I'm gonna get it and I like I got it and I was like so like happy I don't know that's just my passion guys so thank you so so much for your support through all of this and you guys are the reason that I'm you know here where I'm at right now you know what I mean so thank you guys so so much I love you guys so much please keep watching and give me back and give me as much feedback as possible. But let's go ahead and get into some of my favorites for this week. Um, I only have a few, and the very first one I want to talk about is a lipstick that I've been wearing. And it's literally like my go-to lipstick. Um, this is a Barry M lipstick in number 132. And I think it's called like Pinky Gold Sparkle or Shimmer or something like that. I'm not 100% sure because it I got it a while ago, but I love it, guys. I'll swatch it for you. It's so pretty, and it's, like, so natural. It kind of reminds me of Orgasm by NARS. So, but in lipstick form, I love it. And it's so creamy. It's so smooth. These actually are affordable. Um, they're, like, drugstore prices. So if you haven't checked it out, definitely go check out Barry M. They are amazing. As for eyes, don't mind the dirtiness. Um, but I've really been liking this Ultimate Eyes by Smashbox. And ha this is for hazel eyes. I really, really like it because, I don't know, it's just like a taupe. Um, I just love the look that it gives. Um, this is a plum. You get like a grayish taupe, a matte pink. And then this is like a taupe color. I love putting this all over the lid. And this is my crease and that for my you know, brow, and it's just so pretty, I love, like, a taupe eye, it's, like, my favorite thing ever, so I really recommend this, if you can still get it, but I really, really like it. Okay, and the last thing that I talked about, um, before, I'm gonna talk about it one last time to you guys, the Frizzies, John Frieda Frizzies 3 Days Straight Semi-Permanent Styling Spray, um, it looks like this, and it's really, really nice, guys, I barely have any frizz, and I really, really like it, I've been using it for quite some time now, and I really do recommend this product if you have trouble with frizz. I definitely would go out and buy it because it's very affordable. Um, I don't know the price. It's I think it's $6 or something. Um, but definitely go check it out because it's at the drugstore. I mean, you, it's affordable. It's really great if you are dealing with frizz problems. Okay, and now I'm going to move on to my favorite purchases of this week. Um, and slash I'm going to do a little bit of a haul. Um, but I got some things from Sephora. So the first one is this Hello Kitty eyeshadow palette and I've been wanting to get this forever. This is the Say Hello eyeshadow palette and I really like this one and they're originally like $24 and I was like I don't know because the other one that I bought, let me show you, is this one and I paid full price for it. Well I actually, my I got it as a gift. But anyway, this is the Graffiti palette. They aren't super pigmented or anything um, and they're more pastel shades but I just I got it mainly for the blush and, you know, this isn't really a contour color, but it's like a blush. But anyways, I purchased it basically because I liked those, um, but the eyeshadows I don't care for. So, same reasoning, just dropped it, behind this one. First of all, I just love the packaging. It's so cute. It's like a giraffe print, and the Hello Kitty is a bronze reflective metallic and of course her little bow on the top here is so cute. I just love bows. So let's go ahead and show you what it looks like. So it looks like this. It's again in giraffe print with a really pretty bronze bow. And it's so cute. Um, the only thing I noticed when I got mine is that the mirror is loose in it. But I don't really care. See it's like not straight. Um, so I can just glue it in there. But these are the colors that you get. And they are so pretty. I mean, it's just a neutral eye. I'll go ahead and swatch them for you, but these are so pretty, guys. Okay, so actually, I didn't mention I am wearing it on my eyelids today, and I'm only wearing three colors. Um, but I'll swatch them here on my hands in a second. But I have them on my fingertips, guys. They're so shiny. They're so pigmented. This one's my favorite. This one's all over my lid, and this one's 
more towards the outer part of my lid and then this is in my crease. I didn't use the yellow or the golden one today. Um, but that's just wiping them across my hand once. And this one's really cool. It has, it's like peachy. It has like a pink sheen to it. This is a really pretty bronze color. This really pretty brown. And the, the glitter actually goes through it like, it doesn't all chunk up in one area. It's like spread throughout it perfectly, if that makes any sense. And then this gold is typical like any other gold I've ever seen before. Um, I'm not too excited about the gold, but I love everything else. It's amazing. So if you can still go and get it, it's on sale for $11 at Sephora. Definitely check it out if you're interested. I'm going to show you the bottom half in a second. Okay, and so this is what the bottom portion of it looks like. Um, I originally purchased it. I purchased it because the packaging I actually thought was really cute and the eyeshadows I wanted to give another shot. But I, th I thought that this was a bronzer and a highlighter thing. But they're actually both highlighters, which is really cool. This light one over here is more on the it's got a really subtle like you can really barely tell with this one it's not as um noticeable but it is there it's a satin sheen instead of sparkles if you know what i mean and then the other side the peachy side um is more golden and has more of a golden shimmer to it um but again, it's barely there. It's again a satin sheen where the lighter one has more of a silver tone and the peach one has more of a golden tone. But um, I really recommend this, guys. I didn't think it was going to be this good. So if you're interested in finding a different, um, I'll reach and get my towel, um, like a new neutral palette, this one is $11 on sale right now and it's not out of stock. It's been like that forever. Like it's, and I've like never had the money to get it. So now I'm like, getting it. Um, so that's what I got there. Then I also picked up another nail polish, of course, um, again by Hello Kitty. This one's in Blueberry, and it's just like a pale powder blue. Um, I don't really have anything like this in my collection, and the other Hello Kitty bottle that I have is a glitter, so you can't really see her bow. So I wanted to get a cream finish to see if I could see the bow better. It sounds crazy, but I just like, I like the color too. It's very pigmented. I like her polishes were really nice. Um, but this is on sale for $3. Um, normally, I don't know how much they are. I think they're like $10. Um, but yeah, it's in Blueberry. It's going to pick up. And it's just super cute, guys. It's only 3 bucks, and the bottle is adorable, so go get it if you want it. Okay, and then another thing of my favorite, this also came from the Sephora thing, <clears throat> but I did not buy it. It was a 100-point perk if you're like a VIB or something. It was only four like VIBs. Do you know what I mean? Um, and oh my gosh, I was so excited. My voice is cracking. I was so excited to get this as a 100 point perk because it was basically free for me. Um, you know, just 100 points. And it's a Deborah Lipman Mini Nail Polish. Guys, out of all 500 nail polishes, I don't have a Deborah Lipman. I want to get a Deborah Lipman, but I'm like, they're $18. Like, why? What is so amazing about these? And this one is actually a dupe for... Um, another one, OBI, OPI's Rainbow Connection, but this one is a little bit more neon, um, and the bottle is just way freaking cuter, but this one's in Happy Birthday, and it looks like this. Again, it's a mini one, and I believe they sell, like, the mini duos for, like, $18, too. Like, you give them both for $18, which is not a good deal, um, because these, I mean, it's so cute, guys, and it's in Happy Birthday, which, it's ironic because my, I got it yesterday in the mail and it was my brother's birthday yesterday. But guys, it's so cute. And just look at that. Put this over like a black nail polish and it's going to look amazing. Okay, and here is the dupe for it if you don't want to buy a Deborah Lipman nail polish. Um, this one is Deborah Lipman. This is OPI. This is Rainbow Connection. If you can see in Rainbow Connection, it's got all the same glitters in there. And this one, they're a little bit more neon. Um, and all that. But guys, it's so pretty. Like, either one of these is, you know, a good option. So, Rainbow Connection, Happy Birthday. And for some reason they gave me a Happy Birthday thing, which it's not even my birthday. Um, but in it came Benefit What's Up. And it's obviously just a sample size. Um, but I used it today. I'm wearing it right now. Yeah, it's so pretty. Like, I don't know if you can see it on my cheeks right now because the 
light is not shining properly, but there it is. It's just such a pretty, like, champagne-y, shimmery, like, cream product, but it doesn't, like, you know, go into your dryness if you have any, because I do have some. It was perfectly blended in, perfect. I really like it so far. I'll let you know next week what I think about it, um, finally, um, but I really, really like it. It blends so nicely, and I don't know, I just normally like half of Benefit's products and the other half's half I don't like so that one I'm liking so far. Now time for video recap. I uploaded a vlog for 8, 10, and 8, 11 if you're interested. Everything will be linked down below all the videos. Um, I also uploaded a Bliss facial mask review um, and then also a drugstore concealer review 5 in 1. Um, so there's five different concealers from the drugstore in one video for you guys and then also I did the this or that tag which I was tagged by Cecilie Fate that was really fun go check it out if you want to watch a fun video and the last one I uploaded was back to school essentials which I uploaded last night which was supposed to be sassy Saturday and I didn't upload it I'm sorry again I was out and this one's a super long sa sassy Saturday so I hope you guys enjoyed all the video recap links will be down below if you're interested in seeing any, any of them please comment down below give me any feedback that you want to give me I don't care what it is just let me know also give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy please subscribe and I'll talk to you guys later bye